Hi, my name is Barry Crampton. I've been sent this uh, Carlock basic to fit, uh, test and review. I'm pretty sure I like it because I've got the previous one, which is the plug-in one for the EOBD socket. And I have that on my little Citroen Ami. Um, there's no protection as such on an Ami. So this gives you an alarm. Uh, if anybody knocks it, it sends you a message saying it's vibrated or there's a vibration. If they start the engine, you get an alert. And if it moves outside a perimeter that you set on the app, then you get kind of a klaxon alarm. So here we go, here's the box. I'll just show you. Hopefully you can see there. So we'll open it up. Activation card. That's got my code on the back to activate. It is a subscription service. I believe you get the first month free and then uh, you have to pay per month. So we'll just put these, we'll just put that away for the moment. This is it. Now, red and black lead, earth and live. I will pick these things up later, so don't worry. So that's it. The leads are protected and there's a stick on pad at the back here. So um, I'm not sure whether it's fused. I would, connecting it across the battery, I would prefer to see a, a fuse in it. But anyway, um, we'll, we'll fit it. So now then, have I got my 10 millimeter spanner on me? One second. So in order to fit it to the battery, what I'm going to do, I'm going to undo this and rather than fit it here where it will just squash the terminals out, I'm going to try and fit it in between. Hopefully, is that going to tighten up enough? So this is only temporary, so don't don't be moaning about my handiwork again. Yeah, that should be better. Somebody sprayed silicon all over this engine. It won't be our valeter. I can tell you that for nothing. But anyway, we'll tuck those wires down there, stick that to the top. There you go. That's it. Now I need to go about. I was just going to shut the bonnet then with my GoPro. It would have been an expensive video. So we'll open the car lock app to profile and then add vehicle. So we'll add a vehicle activation card which i have here activation code click next select vehicle manufacturer so this one is a vw golf volkswagen golf Europe, London, next. Subscribe to Carlock now. Well, I'm already subscribed. So I'll just click set up later and choose a different plan. So that's it, Volkswagen Golf, it's all done. It expires in or oh, on 30th of the 5th, 2023. We'll just go to the log, no data, smart lock, car lock tag disabled. So we'll manage um, timer lock, timer lock switch on. So you get out of the car and it automatically switches on after five minutes. We'll just try that. Settings, what do I want? Settings, car, imperial, default trip, tag, personal, default map type, 
normal Siri no. monitored circle size normal I'm going to put small so back there signal loss smart lock enabled mute all we don't want that profile as I say it's got mine um, all we need to do now is remember to take my GoPro off which I shall do and uh, we'll see what happens with the with this okay so we're on part two of the uh, the test of this car lock basic um modern cars lots of them have keyless entry keyless go um worst thing that's ever been invented and best thing for for thieves in my opinion With the signal snatcher, all they need to do is go somewhere near your door. If they can pick the signal up from your key, they can then transmit it to the guy who's stood next to your car, who just opens the car, gets in. Keyless entry these days, they don't even have to do anything. They don't even have to take the, the ignition lock out. They just press the button and, and drive off. Now, because they've done it that way, your alarm's not going to go off, so you're not going to hear it in the, in the house. Um, however, with the car lock basic, which is attached to your battery, as I've already shown how to fit, it's there all the time. It's live all the time. As long as your battery, as long as you've not got a flat battery, it, it's perfect. So, first of all, it'll detect a vibration if they do it on your drive. Second, when you start the engine, it will also give you another alert to say the engine's been started. And then you you always you also you can also set this kind of safe zone. So once the car goes out of that zone, you'll get another alarm to say the car's been moved. But then you can also, once it's been moved, you can also track the car. So even if you've missed them breaking in, and believe me these days, you don't want to catch them breaking in your car. If they want your car, they're going to be, they're, they're going to take it. Um, we, we've had a couple of customers uh, who've had very, very nasty experiences where uh, they've not been able to take the car off the drive, so they've broken the house. So th this this alert is best. You're best leaving them to it, let your car go, and then you've got the information here and you can see where it is and, and in inform the police. Let the police do it. Don't, don't be a hero. So this is it now, hopefully. Um, what After you've fitted, it takes about seven days to learn the, the process of the engine starting, where you're traveling and also if I just go in there there's a few other things that you can do um, there's the log of the of the vehicle being moved and the trips I've done in this vehicle so all, all I've done is just just driven around in it till the, till the car lock unit has got used to the, the vehicle um, you see the vehicle move vibration detected engine started engine started engine started and as I say that these are these are my trips it's a, it's a great little system great little secondary system you can see it switched on there you just knock it off just tap that to knock it off when when you come to the car i always forget but you come to the car just knock it off on your phone there but when it's ready, it's it's alarmed and it and it's ready. So we'll just try it. I, I am recording the screen, so you should be able to see what happens. So we get in, start the engine.
we should soon be going out of the little perimeter. So assuming that your car has been loaded onto a um, trailer or something and the engine's not been started, they've not opened the door, they've just dragged it onto a trailer, it should still alert you when it goes out of that circle and as I said, that's when you, you can also track it as well. There you go, there's the vehicle moved and it's showing you whereabouts it's going, what road it's on. For the price of this thing and the subscription, it is a real um, belt and braces kind of thing. Easy to fit, easy to use. You can put the app on your mobile and you can also have it on your desktop. If you've got a teenager and you want to know where they are, again, the, for a few pounds a month, it's, um, it's a no-brainer really. You always know where the car is. see there that's showing exactly where the vehicle is now where it was taken from and where it is at the moment brilliant system for the price I, I, I've got to say and I, I have been using the other one the EOBD car lock um, for nearly the last two years now in, in all my cars and uh, it, it's great, <laughs> well, it's peace of mind. Um, I left my Citroen Ami there. You probably can't see it from there, so I'll just move. But I have one on my Citroen Ami, which is just there. And that's where I park it when it's charging. If I go home in another car, I'll leave it there. And the other night, a vibration alert went off on it. We have a fantastic 4K CCTV system, and one that I can move the camera around. And uh, there was a cat sat on the roof of it. So, you know, it, it's pretty good. I'm gonna switch it off, let it reset itself, eat me donut and drink some coffee. So I'm gonna get out. I'm not gonna set it, I'm gonna let it automatically uh, reset, we'll just make sure that's on. Go into settings, let's see, monitored circle size, vibration en enabled, smart lock enabled. So I'm going to get out and let it set itself. So the security has enabled itself just as the church bells have started ringing next door. Just start the car, see what happens. There you go, engine started. Also, the trip before, just go back, 7th of the 5th, 2023, at 11 o'clock. And there you see, that's the, the trip I made before. And all this you can see on your computer too. It, it's a great system for, for little money. I can uh, recommend it. Thanks for watching, see you in the next video. Bye-bye.